Guys, what's up? It's John, Games 81 Thank you for tuning in. It's good to have you. Uh, this video will be an update video regarding the retro blocks, retro console I did uh, uh, recently on my, my, my channel here, and where I talk about this new retro console coming out very, very soon. I just want to give you guys a heads up. They are changing the name to now Polymega. So they're on Facebook, they have a new website. Uh, it's the same system as before, just different name. And for those who may not know about the Polymega or the retro blocks, it's an advanced retro console coming out soon. Uh, and what it will do out of the box, it will play Sega CD games, TurboGrafx CD games, PlayStation 1 games, and Neo Geo CD games. Uh, and then what they have, they have what they call elements, which you can purchase separately. And those elements will be able, there's the Super Nintendo element, there's an NES one, uh, there is, of course, Super Nintendo will also play uh, Famicom games. Um, they also have uh, TurboGrafx-16 element, uh, Sega Genesis Mega Drive element. So there's a, there's a bunch of different elements. You can just put them in there and it will enable you to play these games. Now, this isn't like a ROM dumping machine like the Retron 5 is. This will actually read off the cart. Um, and what's cool, there's a really cool interface. You can do uh, Twitch streaming through this thing. You can uh, share it to your social media. So they're taking elements uh, of what basically of, of modern gaming and they're playing to to retro gaming. It's all in HD, uh, which is fantastic. And what's really cool about the system is it is, when I previously announced this thing coming out, uh, they were going to do a Kickstarter and they still might for pre-order purposes, but this thing is fully funded already. So this, this system is coming out regardless. Uh, I've gotten to know Brian and the team fairly well over the year plus that they've been working on this machine. I was personally able to see it, uh, hold the controller, see it in action, and I can tell you this thing looks legit. So if you're huge into retro gaming, which I'm assuming you are because you're watching this video, uh, I encourage you guys to follow them on Facebook, check out their website. Uh, they're gonna add more elements uh, in the future. I believe like even the old school systems like the Atari 2600 are in the works, all that good stuff. So they're gonna add more. It's just like an all encompassing system. So it's kind of like the Retron 5, so to speak, but a little bit more modern, uh, and you can add these elements and customize it, which is really sweet. So out of the box, you can play, what, four different systems out of the box, that, you know, which is sweet, and then you can add elements in addition. Uh, the controller looks really cool. There are controller ports you can actually plug in, uh, old school controllers as well, which is definitely a huge benefit. Um, and it's just cool keeping retro gaming alive. These guys are huge enthusiasts. And the guys who worked on this project, uh, Brian and his team, they've actually been working on games uh, for years. Uh, and they've been part of the gaming uh, development process for years. In fact, Brian personally worked on the Ratchet and Clank series, which I'm sure many of you have heard of. Um, and uh, so it's cool. So they definitely know what they're doing. And the engineering behind this thing is, is crazy. So again, I'll put a link below to their website. I'll put a link to their Facebook, social media. I encourage you guys to follow these guys. Let me know what you guys think about the, the Polymega. Do you guys think this is a good idea? What do you guys think? Leave a personal comment below. Thank you for liking this video. Thank you for subscribing. Uh, we'll see you guys soon. Take care and... Game on.